channel rebranding I think will be bad for NASCAR fans. Pure and simple. I'm going to link to an article through jsky.com or through that they're going to carry this, that, and the other. I think it mentions college basketball, college football, Major League Baseball. This takes effect August 1st. Now, it does mention that Race Day, Victory Lane, and Race Hub will be on. No mention is made of Speed Center. No mention is made of Wind Tunnel. It also says beginning in 2015, some Sprint Cup races will be carried on Fox Sports 1. Basically, what that means is more and more I'm going not only to cable, but basically to... I know my cable system and a lot of cable systems, if you're on Inside AOL, Time Warner, have Speed Channel as a premium or almost a movie type channel in a package like that that's called the Sports Tier on my particular cable system. Includes several of the ESPN channels not available elsewhere, ESPN Classic, ESPN News. So more and more, the even the Sprint Cup races are going to be going going to um, basically what I almost call pay cable. Bad idea, Fox. Bad idea. When you started this, you had more and more of them on regular TV. Then you started moving them. You moved the All Star Race to Speed Channel. Now the 125 mile qualifiers being now going to prime time on Speed on speed channel to be rebranded Fox Sports 1. This is actually going to hurt. What about the fans who don't watch the truck races? Maybe they go to their local Saturday night short track so they don't watch the all-star race live, you know, it's probably on replay somewhere, and don't have speed slash Fox Sports 1. These are the people you're going to hurt. Fox, if you don't want the races, some other networks are interested in betting. Let them have them. Don't be shifting them, shifting the races to pay what I call pay channels. I frankly think it's a bad idea. If you notice subtle little changes this season in the programming. Now, Race Hub stays the same. Race Day stays the same. Race Hub's an hour show. Race Day's a two-hour show except for certain bigger races such as Daytona where it's a three hour show. But did anybody notice both Wind Tunnel and Victory Lane cut down from an hour show to a half hour show? The subtle little changes are already taking place. Maybe us fans can email Fox and say, hey, bring back our shows. What happens to Speed Center? I might have said that before. If I did, I did. But it's I was reading this article and it made me a little bit mad, so I decided to make this vlog. And that's the end of it.